All right, so let's say we want to make this page work to generate some conversions as a sales page. So I will go to the editing mode. I will do the button editing, right? Let's suppose in this button, for, for example, when I will click on this, so the button options are going to be loaded over here. If I want some changes, I can do that, right? At the same time, what I want this button to do, I want it to take to the bottom of the page at a pricing table or something. That is something that it will do. Or I want the product to be connected over here. So inside FlexiFunnels, as you know, that you can create products and uh, you can connect the products over here. So let's say you have created a product. You just, you know, let's say connect it over here and whatever your product is. And, you know, let's say after connecting it, um, you can you can just put it over here. For example, let's say just randomly this product and just click on save changes. So now this page is, uh, you know, this button is going to take to a checkout page. By the way, if you are somebody who is new and you do not know how to create products inside FlexiFunnels, I will simply recommend you to go to help.flexifunnels.com, um, the knowledge base, okay. Uh, inside FlexiFunnels dashboard, you will find all the knowledge base, all the trainings. We have seen that live chat support. We have one-to-one uh, -one call bookings available. So like everywhere you have help resources which are available to you, right? So let's say if I take you over here to AI Builder once again. So um, um, if you will see right inside your dashboard, you have this live chat support, we have uh, uh, human support, we have uh, AI support, and uh, we have knowledge base articles right over here. Um, if you will click over here, you can click on uh, this knowledge base you will reach the knowledge base right over here so all the articles everything is present let's say you want to learn how to create a product just type over here steps to create a digital product in flexible creating a free product or you can click on view all and you will find all the articles and you know all the step-by-step -step instructions key how to create the product how to launch the product um, so all these trainings are done right this course uh, is currently for a website building the product tutorials, everything has been covered for you. In fact, uh, if you will go to timeline nomination also. So in the FlexiMath tutorials, we have given you all these lessons, like how to create a product, how to create a course, all those things have been covered, right? So let's come back and uh, let's look at the, the button. So button, uh, in the button, you can, you can add a product, you can add a funnel if you want or you can add a product if you want, like we have added, and click on save changes, right? So this is how you can do the button-based editing. You want to change the text of the button, you can do that. Or you want the button to take to any specific uh, URL, you know, maybe uh, you, you don't want uh, the drag, but you want, let's say, some URL. So you can put, let's say, google.com. I mean, you will have to put the full link, let's say, http.google.com, like, like the full URL. But again, if you want it to take to some other URL, you can do that. Or you just want uh, the product to be connected over here, you can do that. You will click on save changes. And this is how the changes are going to be done right over here. 